think I'm just gonna go home and cut out pictures of men. <laughs> come on, just come to the party for you. What's, oh, what's the point? I've resigned myself to the fact that I'm gonna spend the rest of my life alone. Oh, come on. <laughs> Look at you. You're gorgeous. Oh. No, I don't know, you just have to put yourself out there. Hi. Hi. What are you doing with my drop? Oh, you remember me from the news agency? You dropped the docket to your dry cleaning when you arrived at my newspaper. How did you find her? Oh, I went to the dry cleaners. And they told you where I were? Oh, well, I just said that I was your house called Coco and they pointed me here to this building. <laughs> How did you find my office? I'm not listed in the lobby. I described you. To who? To the receptionist on the first 33 floors. Hang on. You tracked her down just to deliver her dry cleaning? Not exactly. How did you describe me? Listen, I feel like I'm being grilled here. You, you are. are. <laughs> who, who are you? Jack. Jack Chandler. I don't hate it. How did you describe me, Jack? Pushy. Pushy but pretty. You think I'm pretty? Yeah. I am late for that party. So, I am just going to take this because your fingers are turning blue. Right. <laughs> Nice to meet you, Jack. Chandler. Oh, I didn't get the stain out. Oh, I hope you didn't pay them for this. Actually, I did. It's okay. Well, it's not okay because they didn't get the stain out. What stain? Well, right there. That's a stain. Oh, I didn't even see that. Sorry. Well, did you get a receipt? No. Why didn't you get a receipt? Oh, I don't know. It never occurred to me. What, you don't know how to get a receipt? No, it's the first time I've ever picked up a strange woman's dry cleaning. Oh, um, how much do I owe you? No, don't worry, it's okay. Well, I'm not going to let you pay for my dry cleaning. It was my pleasure. Just here's 20 bucks. No, it was 17, okay? Just take it. Listen, I didn't come here for a tip. What did you come here for then? I wanted to meet you. Why? Because ever since I saw you yesterday, I can't stop thinking about you. Well, how do I know you're not some axe murderer? Do these, do these look like the hands of an axe murderer? How do you know I'm not a married woman? Oh, no, really. How do you know I'm not a married woman who's just been mugged? You know, you're making this very hard, you know. What would you do if some woman walked into your office with your dry cleaning? Oh, well then I'd just say, Mum, go away! <laughs> well, look, can I buy you dinner? Oh, God. Oh, God. Is that an answer? What do you expect me to say? About, sounds great, what time do you want to pick me up? Please don't make me do this. Do what? I can't take dating anymore. It's not just... I spent the whole day trying to track you down. I didn't ask you to come up I here. I know that. No, I wanted to. And I appreciate it, I, I really do. Thank you. For the laundry. Okay. You know what? <laughs> When you're crying in your Chardonnay that you can't meet a nice guy, just remember that you met one and you pushed him out the door. Do you swear that you told 33 people today that I was pretty? Pretty? With a sexy voice? He did not. I'll go down to level 32 and ask Meredith. Just trust me. But I don't know you. And I don't know you either. How am I supposed to trust you then? I could be standing down on George Street right now, selling your clothes for a tidy profit. You wouldn't do that. Oh, that's what I'm saying. Well, will you tell me something honestly, Jack Chandler? Do you like parties? I love parties. Claudia Sinclair. <laughs>